AI will soon make it possible for one person to build a billion dollar company. That my friends is a quote from the founder and CEO of OpenAI. But to most of you, that sounds completely impossible. So in this video, I'm gonna show you the three step process that makes this possible, not just in a distant future, but today. And by using this exact framework, I was able to double my business over the past three months. So whether you're just getting started or you have a thriving business, this is gonna take things to the next level for you. And by the way, if you think this video is a big promise followed by a bunch of fluff, you have another thing coming. I'm not just gonna break down this process for you. I'm also gonna be giving you the exact tools that you can use to get started today. And yes, I'll have options for people who are not technical at all and others who are a little more tech savvy. Let's jump in. Okay, so the first challenge in building a billion dollar business is, well, that not all businesses can reach a billion dollars. And that's why we need to focus on building a business that has the highest likelihood of reaching a billion dollar valuation. Now, in making this decision, there are three key things that we want to focus on. Number one is that we build a product that we do not have to have a person fulfill. Well, first of all, because we're building this solo. So we need to find a product that delivers the value without you as a human having to be involved in the process of delivery or fulfilling on that product. The second important thing is that this has to be a business that is highly scalable, meaning that we should be able to target people online without having to worry about where they live. If our business type doesn't have global potential, it's very unlikely it'll be able to reach the status. Now, the third thing is that this has to be a highly profitable business. Why? Because when we're talking about a $1 billion business, it means that the valuation of this company is to be a billion dollars, meaning that we have to be able to generate hundreds of millions of dollars and have a high profit margin. And so you'll realize there's really only one type of company that allows you to build a billion dollar business solo. And the business that hits all three criteria is a software business also known as SaaS. One, the product delivers itself to the customers. You just pay for a subscription or get some credits and you have access to the product. Two, you can scale globally. And three, whereas other businesses have profit margins of 30, 40% at best, software businesses go up to 90% in profitability, meaning that these companies can be sold for up to 10 times the value of their annual revenue. And there are so many examples of this. SendGrid, an email marketing tool sold to Twilio for $3 billion. GitHub sold to Microsoft for $7.5 billion. And Figma sold to Adobe for $20 billion. Okay, Christian, but how do I build an AI powered software business? I'm glad you didn't ask, but I'm gonna answer that question anyway. The short answer is AI. The long answer is that there are now these AI coding platforms that allow you to build sophisticated apps, enhance their capabilities with AI and start getting paid customers. Don't believe me? Follow me. This, my friends, is Lovable, one of my favorite AI coding platforms specifically focused on non-technical people. But obviously, if you're a coder, you can use it to and access all the code. This kind of platform allows you to come here and prompt based just build out your app. So let's try this. Build an Airbnb clone for students to find and book washing machines near their campus. And now I'm just gonna press enter. And what this platform is now doing is that it is starting to actually write code out for us. So you're gonna see in just a second that the code is being generated in the background. And as soon as it's ready, it's going to be showing me a preview inside this window here on the right hand side. Look at that thing go. Now this will take a couple of minutes, but it's not just creating designs. It's not just creating like a website. It's actually creating a functional web app that includes integrations to a database that we'll do right after, payments, authentication, meaning sign in, sign out, log in, log out, etc. And you'll be able to publish it to a custom domain. And boom, just like that, I have a first version. As we can see, I'm gonna just open this up inside the previewer here to really get a good look at this. It is insane what this thing has just built with one prompt. This was one shot. Now, of course, I'm gonna be able to adapt anything that I want, but as you can see, it's already finding different campuses. I can put University of California, Berkeley. I can perform a search. Of course, it does not yet have any data. That's something that we would do afterwards, but it's created a first version. Let's check it out. It's actually very beautiful. It shows different campuses with the uh, amount of machines that are around. And here, there are basically the machines themselves. So. Yeah, this looks really good for a very first version in a one-shot prompt. You would basically from here be able to adapt via prompt as well. So if I come back here, I can have it change things and I'm gonna start building the actual app. Then I would ask for it, could you add authentication? We'll go through that process. 
Could you please attach this to the database, et cetera, et cetera. Basically, without any coding skills at all, you can build out your first version of your product and launch it in the market. And if you're looking for an alternative, there's also a platform called bolt.new, as well as one called Replit. And all the links are in the description. Now, if you're a little more technical inside those platforms, you can also go into the code base and adapt it, but you also have alternatives like Cursor, which is a great co-pilot, Windsurf, which is another alternative, or VS Code. And yes, before you ask, you can also build mobile apps leveraging a platform called Expo. You're now gonna be in the process of finding product market fit, adapting the product so that it fits the market properly, people pay for it. But once that's all done, you start getting bigger problems. That probably will be able to bring you to about $100,000. So now that you have a product and you have customers, with that comes you being busy. And that's the biggest bottleneck that you currently have in building a $1 billion solo business. So how can we fix that? Well, the answer is you need to create a scalable process that is gonna allow you to free up your time again. And the first thing we're gonna to wanna to target there is your repetitive tasks. Everyone has the experience of being busy with repetitive tasks day in, day out, that frankly are quite mundane, AKA a huge energy drain for you. And if we don't get our time back, we're working in our business and we can't work on our business. But here's the good news, my friend. Now that we're actually working with real customers, we're faced with real problems. And for each one of those real problems, we can create an automated workflow that allows us to solve that problem without having to be there every single time. So think of this as a way to kill your repetitive tasks through beautiful automation. By the way, if you're a business owner and constantly find yourself stuck in endless spreadsheets and you have so many mundane repetitive tasks that you're doing every single day, then I have some good news and some bad news. The bad news is that unless you do something about it, you're gonna be stuck in a mountain of work. The good news is that we have a program that helps you completely automate your processes, leveraging AI. In just 12 weeks, we'll transform your business. And we'll do that with a combination of AI agents, automations, and sometimes even internal tools. It's called the AI operator. And the first thing we do is jump in your business and understand how we can improve your current process to make it fully automated, figuring out the priorities that are gonna save you lots of time. And then we build out all of these agents and automations with you so that we can streamline your business and you can get back to growing it. If that sounds nice and you wanna work with us, apply it, there's a link below here in the description. Back to the video. And there are a number of tools that are gonna be able to do this exactly the way you want them to. You wanna onboard and educate new customers, there's an automation for that. You wanna avoid repetitive emails, there's an automation for that. Write customer proposals, there's an automation for that. Okay, I'm gonna stop because it's sounding like an ad now. But seriously, there are platforms like Zapier, Make, and N8N that allow you to create incredibly powerful automations that run in your sleep. And as a first principle, you have to think, where do you spend the most actual time today and how can you have that thing be automated for you? Because if we're building a billion dollar business, you're gonna have to be very focused on building the business. And if you think you can only build very simple automations, check this out. This automation allows me to speak to Slack, which is my messaging platform, and it automatically generates a LinkedIn post that's highly optimized. The way it does that is that we have a webhook, which is the trigger. As soon as I speak into that Slack channel, it automatically sends that into ChatGPT, creates a first version of it, then it sends it to Claude, which creates a second version of it. This is kind of like an editor. And then it sends it back as a text file. Okay, so let's test this thing out in action. I've actually attached it to Slack. So here I've created an actual channel called Content Ideas. And if I come here, I can record my voice and I can tell it what I'd like this post to be about. Let's try it out. Hey, what's up AI? Hope you're doing well. <laughs> Love being polite to AI. Could you please create a post about how vibe coding or coding with AI tools like Lovable or Bolt are allowing people to build apps incredibly quickly. However, there's a big problem. And the problem is that most people have no idea how to scope their apps, how to build a minimum viable product, something that is gonna be a minimal version of what they have in terms of their idea for the app that is actually monetizable and that people will love. So please create a post about that. And then we're gonna send it off here, boom. Excellent, we saw the transcript is created, which is actually what we need to actually trigger this automation to take place. And in just a couple seconds, boom, there in real time, we see it's created an actual post for us. Hey entrepreneurs, just wanted to chat about the latest buzz in no code. AI powered app builders like Lovable and Bolt, exciting, right? But there's a catch many are overlooking. 
So I basically created an entire post, and this is just one of many examples of things that we can build with AI automation. Okay, so now you've built a scalable product, you've automated all of your repetitive tasks, so you've basically bought back your time. And now my friends, we need to build a team to be able to execute and bring this to billion dollar status. Wait, Christian, you told us that we were gonna be doing this solo. That's right, but I'm actually talking about building an entire team of AI agents that each have specific tasks that they can do, and they can do those at a very high level. Christian, what are you talking about? Well, most of you already heard of AI but you can actually train AIs on specific knowledge to do a very specific task. And when we talk about agents, they are autonomous. They can learn by actually doing that task. So they get better and better at doing the task the more they actually perform the task. And they're able to determine what next steps they actually have to be taking. Christian, this sounds a little bit like what you were talking about earlier. Correct. So think of it this way. Automations are going to basically be like an intern. You give them very specific tasks and they're gonna be very good at doing those individual tasks. Whereas agents are gonna be a lot better at being full-time employees that are able to execute on those tasks in the same way that a medium level professional would be able to. And there are a handful of tools that make this process a lot easier than you might think. I'm not technical, I'm not technical, I'm not technical. I get that, I get that, I get that. That's why we're gonna be talking about two different categories of tools. Some that are really focused on people who are not technical and others that are for more technical people. This is Lindy, a platform that allows you to build custom agents based on your specific use case. And what I love about this platform is its simplicity. So you can create an agent that accompanies you in each one of your Zoom meetings and then gives you a full transcript afterwards and even transforms that transcript into action items and maybe even sends those action items inside your project management tool. Okay, Christian, don't get too carried away here. The point is that you select a trigger, like something happening for it to trigger that action. You connect it to your apps and then you give custom instructions via AI. There are plenty of templates that you can use and they leverage all the tools that you probably already use. If you're a little bit more confident in your technical skills, I would go for something like N8N. This is a very powerful tool that allows you to do more complex, more custom jobs. It even allows you to self-host the platform if you're doing a bunch, meaning that you would pay almost nothing to get these agents to run. And so with agents, you're able to build a team that can do things like customer support to the highest level, create content that you can post on platforms to start getting attention and get leads, call prospects and answer any questions they might have about your products or services better than the average person would be able to, generate proposals, analyze your marketing performance. So thinking back to the quote of building billion dollar businesses solo, we're gonna be able to achieve that by building highly scalable products that are able to be sold and scaled globally, then to automate all the tasks that start taking us a lot of time, and eventually to build an entire army of AI agents who are able to do tasks at a high level. In fact, Sam doesn't just believe in this, he actually has bets going with his friends of who's gonna build the first one person billion dollar business. But here's the truth. Now, building a billion dollar business assumes that we find product market fit. And nothing in this video is useful unless you have first paying customers. So if you're interested in learning how to go from idea to first paying customer without writing a single line of code, well then I highly recommend you check out this video because there I'm gonna teach you how to build an app from scratch without any coding skills at all. And if you enjoyed this video and wanna learn more about how you can launch your own businesses without coding, then please subscribe, like, and I'll see you in the next one. Let's go.